The military has given media a rare look at its survival training center in Kaohsiung. The facility is equipped with state-of-the-art technology, including a wave generator that can simulate storms at sea. FTV's news team saw soldiers put their skills to the test, escaping scenarios that were straight out of a disaster movie. Inside a 5-meter deep pool at 6.8 million NT, Belgium-made wave vault bobs up and down, simulating waves that arise with force four winds. Lightning and rain effects add to the scene, creating a disaster zone. In this simulation, an aircraft crashes into the sea. The plane cabin rotates 180 degrees underwater, and the crew leaps to action, showcasing their training. In a flash, they open the doors to escape the submerged cabin. This simulation equipment was made in Canada, and more than 40 countries around the world use it for training. In a real disaster situation, you're often up against inclement weather, so we use these environmental effects to recreate those harsh conditions here. This all happened at the Military Survival Training Center in Kaohsiung, where members of the Air Force learn survival skills that could be used out at sea and on land. Trainees are subjected to a range of exercises, escaping a vehicle that's been flipped 180 degrees, undergoing a helicopter rescue at sea, or parachuting into the ocean without wind. They learn to stay clear-headed to get out of dangerous situations. At all times, you're on your own. You have to know how to overcome any difficulties. The Defense Ministry's training regime allows Air Force members to be prepared for any emergency and to boost survival and rescue rates in a crisis.